All right, guys, so what I'm going to show you here is my setup on how to connect the smoke detector um, alarm to your relay, which can control a bunch of devices. But for this use, I'm going to use a magnetic door controller or holder. And... Um, it's currently magnetized since there's power going through it and it's all powered up right now with 120 volts it's getting supplied to the smoke detector the relay and i just have a 120 volts set up here okay and now i'm going to show you how i have it connected um so there's my drawing. You can um, pause it and copy it. So pretty much the smoke detector is here and it's getting power. And if you have another smoke detector in parallel with it, it'll work also. Um, you have the three lines, which are the power 124 volts, signal, interconnect, and the neutral. And, and that's going through the relay module. Um, the colors are there. And it's pretty simple wiring, actually. And it uses pretty much the neutral to the magnetic holders and use 120 volts from the relay to keep it powered up. All right, here we go. So to continue on, um, I'm currently using this kitty or kid um, relay and the part number is SM120X and this is the drawing that comes with the adapter or sorry the relay how it's connected and when you buy it it'll give you the actual drawing so everything is per manufacturer um, directions here and the color code of course will tell you there and if you also buy the smoke detector we'll also give you a diagram on how to connect both to the system as you can see here too much um, using the relay over here on the side here uh, it's not really focusing well here but um, and it's pretty simple and if you buy the parts you will get the diagram how to connect that up and what I'm using here for the magnetic door holder is this um, psycho alarm magnetic door holders um, the part number is right there you have a couple options surface mount or flush mount um, I currently have the flush mount here but I may change it to the surface mount anyways um, you can buy all this in Amazon um, not sponsored by any of these products but I just uh, wanted to install it so here we go um, so the yellow line and the white neutral needs to go to the magnetic holder as you can see here and if you're looking at it at this direction um, it 
There you go. I don't know, the focus kind of sucks sometimes. Um, maybe it's not that great to be focused. See, I might have changed cameras and do it again. Let me see. Um, so I got that. And you have the black, red, and the white. The black is what I call black hot, as in 124 volts. The red is the signal that transmits the 9 volt signal when it triggers. And the white line is the neutral um, wiring. As you can see here, I have all the neutrals together and I have the blacks together. So the blue line is the common line that's going to the adapter. And that 124 volts, 120 volts is going to get used for the um, um, normally open relay or normally closed relay. So I'm currently using as a normally closed relay. And um, so when it triggers, it will disable this 120 volts because it's normally closed. It will open it when it triggers, okay? And if you look at this drawing here from the manufacturer, you'll see inside that box, it's not that great zooming in. Um, you'll see inside the box how that relay works, okay? So the yellow is normally closed and the gray is, I believe, normally open. Sorry, orange. I'm not using orange. It's normally on or uh, normally open. The gray is another nine volt signal, which I'm really not going to use right now. But I'm sure I can probably use it um, somehow later on. Um, so here we go. Let's test it out. And it should disable when I trigger the test. And I'm just going to perform a test on smoke detector is going to be loud so here we go there you go it dropped Fire. it released okay and as you can see and that's how you test it and it should be good and it should stick back on there just like so I may install uh, another switch to disable this magnet whenever I want I'll just have a push button to disable it to disengage the magnet because it's very strong um, coil magnet here all right hopefully you guys like it uh, subscribe follow um, whatever you guys do like I don't usually do this to make money I'm just trying to educate people with what I do thank you